Hey everyone, for my project I will be using Tableau Desktop to tell a story of a comprehensive data set from NASA containing info on all the known meteorite landings. So I'm just opening up the data set that I downloaded from NASA's open data site. Okay. Okay. So since I know I want to view this data on a geographical map, I need to correct the latitude and longitude settings. So these will always be decimals. Okay, so we're just going to show the number of records here. Just double click on that and it's just about under 25,000. Okay, so now I'm going to choose latitude and longitude and select the geographical map. So here, all the dots represents all the known meteorites that have been recorded on this data set. Okay, so I can filter this data set by meteorites that have fell and were recorded at the time of the event or by meteorites that were found and were recorded at the time that it was found. So for per training purposes, I'm just going to select both of them so I can display all the data on the map. Then I can just show you guys what it would look like for meteorites that were found versus fell. Okay. All right, so let's dig into the data by establishing marks. So for mass, I'll add that to size, for class, color, and name, label. Now I wanna add more details to this, so I'm gonna add year to the detail mark. Okay, and now if we hover over here, we can see that the name of this meteorite is Cape York, and it's an iron class. Okay, so if we're interested in finding out information about a certain class, for example, I'm going to choose a Martian meteorite. I'm going to select Martian and then keep only. And this will show me the meteorite from Mars, its location, its mass, and we can make this larger. We can also change the color. Pretty cool, huh? Okay, so let's remove this guy. Okay, now we can see all the meteorites. Now I want to zoom into the US. It's a meteorite in Arizona. Okay, so now we are going to add the year to the pages field. 
And this will create a motion chart where we can animate through a period of time the visualization and play the history of all the recorded meteorites. So we just selected all history and we're going to hit play. So this motion chart is going through all the years in the data set and displaying all the meteorites that have fell and were recorded on that given year. Pretty cool stuff here. Okay. So I hope that my video was not only entertaining but also educational and thanks for your time.